for Washington State, a successful Crimson and Gray game in Spokane. Dom Williams had a big day himself, uh, one of the stars of the afternoon, along with Mike Pulaski, Guy Haberman. Now, last year, of course, it was Connor Halliday, Vince Bailey. Today, it was Luke Falk and, and Don Williams. One of the things that Washington State has to do this year, obviously, replace Connor Halliday. And Luke Falk, who came in last year at the end of the season, showed that he was going to pick up right where he left off. Very efficient with the ball in his hands and had that hookup. Like Halliday to Craycraft last year, Halliday to Maley this year, it was Luke Falk to Don Williams. Very good out there on the outside, turning small catches into big gains, turning the slant into the touchdown. And Luke Falk did an excellent job of remaining a quarterback in that position. He showed that veteran leadership, the experience in the system, and looked very good today in the spring game. Yeah, Mike Leach said they've got a lot coming back in terms of experience. Mainly almost 1,500 receiving yards last season. So from what we saw today, uh, when you look ahead to the fall and into the season for Washington State, how do they improve upon two conference wins last year? Didn't lose a lot. They lost some big players on offense, but they feel good about receiver. Quarterback has to fill in. But defense is really the big difference. Get a defense that goes out and wins with the addition of Alex Grinch, the new defensive coordinator. They're going to see try to put more pressure on the quarterback and be ball hawks. Find a way to change that turnover takeaway ratio to take it from minus 17 into the positive. If they can do that with the offense that Mike Leach always puts up, this will be a very good football team in the Pac-12. Looking forward to Mike Leach's fourth season at Washington State, and that is still to come in the fall. As for us here in Spokane, the Crimson over the Gray.